So when you guys want to ask me about it? Wing it. Wing it. Wing it. All right, let's wing, wing it. With more. <laughs> Who's your favorite coach? No, we all know the we right all know the right one. Yeah, don't worry. We all know the correct answer here. Yeah. John Cornette, I love you. You're a great coach. There is none better than Kenneth Camp. You can edit that, right? Hey! <laughs> I suck at that. Get the frick out. <laughs> My mentor. <laughs> Great God. He's tender on the inside. Do you have any pets? I have a dog. What's the dog's name? Bear. Breed. <laughs> Eight. Gender. Female. Four. Color. Black and white. How's your social life? It's pretty good, man. I've got like six followers on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> Danny, what are your plans after high school? I want to go to Georgia, University of Georgia. Get a degree in business finance. Make money. Okay, maybe someone a little less boring. Chase? Chase, what are your plans after high school? Well, I haven't decided on the exact university, but I want to go and get a degree in engineering. And I've decided when I get to college, my Just wardrobe to consists Three things. Shorts. Like just plain cargo shorts. Okay? Gray shirts. And Steve Spurrier Pie. I have a great question to ask now. Ask now. <clears throat> Chase. No. Are you concerned that by letting your hair grow out you're beginning to resemble kind of red? Only slightly. Here's why. See, my hair isn't Trevor's hair because I'm not Trevor and I don't think I have to worry about anyone confusing me with Trevor because Trevor's not me. I have a question. You two went to the movies together. <laughs> Actually, here's story time to me and Danny. This is June of 2017. You know what? Let's get a job from the movies. Okay? So we're working at the movies. This is a good one. Crawford says, Man, I've got a job at Brass Town. And then you say, you say, I'm going to quit my job to go work at the movies with Chase and Danny. Yeah. So here's the question. So you're from Union County. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Do you like Towns County better? I do. I do. I have moved here. I've lived here for two years now. I just, I like living in this town better. I like the school system. And I like the kids. I think we have a higher quality of kids around here. Kids that you want to be around and kids that you want to see succeed in sports and in life. Yeah. Can I ask him some questions? Yeah. yeah. Oh, let's yeah. go ahead. Dan, what has been your most memorable moment this school year? Give me a moment from school and give me a moment a moment from football. With football, it'll probably be beat Hayesville. I don't do a lot in regular school day, but probably be working on the videos. That's kind of cool. I throw a football with this guy like two hours a day every day. Every day. That's pretty much it. Question, Ken, Ken, what led you to become so fascinated with the city of Buffalo? Well, and it's not so much the city of Buffalo as is the professional football team that resides there, the Buffalo Bills. I'm not a huge Sabres fan, per se, out of the National Hockey League. But as you know, my associate, Chase Rogers, is a Cleveland Browns fan. Yes. And well, so, we're dog pal. Woo! Yes. So, two years ago, it was homecoming week, and so Thursday was throwback Thursday. And so I thought it would be appropriate to wear my dad's state championship baseball jersey to school one day. However, when I got to school, from the moment I sat down in class to the moment the bell rang, I had all four classes with this guy. And so all day long, he called me the only Buffalo Bills fan south of the Mason-Dixon line because our old school colors were, believe it or not, red, white, and buffalo blue. So yeah, he did that, and I'm like, you know what? Fine, whatever. I'll be a Bills fan. It can't be that bad. And I said, oh wait, it is that bad. We haven't made the playoffs in 18 years. What have I done? I went to high school with a kid named Josh Allen. He's probably better at football than the guy. 